Hi, Charlene here from Radical Feng Shui with Charlene and a beautiful deck garden in Victoria. So I just want to get into the different elements, the different colors, and the different meanings when we're doing plants in a garden, and especially if you're using a power garden to amp up your own intentions. I would encourage you to do some more research about what type of plants you want to embellish your garden with. Um, just kind of look it up because it's really interesting the different meanings to the plants. And I'm gonna start with the east, wood. These symbologies like a tree, it's all about renewal and growth. It's about optimism. It's about really setting an intention. Now we're going to be using green probably around the edges of a power garden. So I'm talking about power gardens because we're looking at all the colors and all the walls, but this is anywhere in your gardens, using these elements and knowing how to use them in the different areas. The east and the southeast. East is community, health, southeast fortunate blessings. So these are the colors we're gonna use. And I recommend sage because sage is all about wisdom and it's about renewal and it's about immortality. So we can use sage as a, an edge garden. Or we can use it in one of the two east or southeast blocks. The next element we'll talk about is fire. It's about the middle of the summer. It's about coming into summer now and it's the shape of a triangle. Not that you may find red plants that are triangular, but it's good to know the shape. Fire, always about passion. It's about inspiration. It's about what's coming next. It's, um, it's, all, it's often about love. So when we use the color red, we're invoking that in our lives. And red purple is a little different. Red purple invokes spirituality and tantric energy. So it has a different take when we're using the color red. Remember triangular shapes or planting them in a triangle. Next color we're using, next element, is earth. Now earth has a variety of colors. We have pinks, we have oranges, we have um, yellows, and they all have a little bit of a different meaning. If we're using pinks, we're gonna be using them in a power garden or anywhere. We use them in the southwest, we use them in the northeast, and then the sacred center of the Tai Chi. Pink is all about happiness and joy. It's about that happy, lovely, calming energy. Whereas yellow is a little more um, about gracefulness and pulling in the energy of flowing with grace and renewal. Oranges are more about wisdom and they're about, you know, kind of a higher octave. They can be um, also kind of jarring color. We see them worn on the monks because it is about a lot of wisdom. Great color to plant in the north east because that's the knowledge area. Stay tuned and please subscribe. Ciao!